Sam Madden. I'm a professor of electrical engineering and computer science here at MIT. I work in the area of software systems, specifically building software tools to manage very large amounts of data. One of the things that I do here at MIT is to head something known as the Intel Science and Technology Center in Big Data. So Intel has sponsored several of these technology centers throughout the country over the last two or three years. And the specific one we have in the area of big data is focused on building software systems and tools that can take advantage of new hardware trends that Intel may be developing to really improve the performance of data intensive algorithms or so that Intel can understand how data is going to change the hardware that they ought to be building or so that Intel can understand how the uh, hardware that they're building can best be used to process large amounts of information. This is a multi-university and multidisciplinary uh, initiative, so it involves about 10 faculty from MIT as well as 8 to 10 faculty from other universities around the country. A lot of what we do is to try and get together people from different sub-areas of computer science to think about hard and interesting problems. So we might take an architect who understands next generation hardware technologies like flash memory uh, and combine them with somebody who's really good at algorithms and talk about how would we take you know, a, a specific algorithm and make it run really efficiently on this piece of hardware. The other initiative that I'm responsible for and run on campus here is something known as Big Data at CSAIL. Big Data at CSAIL is complementary to the Intel Science and Technology Center in Big Data. It's really focused on reaching out to other industry partners uh, in, the, in the country and internationally really um, who have an interest in Big Data. What Big Data at CSAIL is about is less about focusing on specific technologies that might be uh, of interest to our member companies and more about trying to educate our member companies about what big data is, what the sort of big trends are. We run a series of workshops, um, we produce white papers, we pr run a seminar series where it's really about getting lots of knowledge and information about technology out there. So of course big data is one of the sort of hyped buzzwords in technology these days and you hear it all over the place and I think um, it's, it's become so commonplace that sometimes it's hard to understand what people really mean when they talk about big data. To us inside of CSAIL, what we're really focused on when we talk about big data is just technologies for making sense and processing the ever increasing volume and diversity of data that arrives. Big data is not so much that it's data that consists of a huge number of bytes, lots of information, but it's just doing things with data that you maybe couldn't do previously or trying to make it so that people who uh, have data sets who didn't necessarily apply cutting edge com computer science techniques to those data sets previously can start to apply those techniques to their data. So you sometimes hear people talking about um, volume, velocity, and variety, the three V's of big data. And I think that's a reasonable way to think about this. I mean, volume is, yeah, sometimes data is just really big. Velocity is increasingly data is coming at you really fast. And actually, I think variety is where the big challenges, the big new research problems in big data come up. Variety just means the data is much more complex. It's not just this sort of tabular data that you might stick in a spreadsheet or a database system. Suddenly people are talking about um, trying to process very complex things like graphs of relationships between people in a social network or trying to make sense out of images um, or trying to extract and mine patterns in data. And so um, those are the kinds of things that we, we educate are trying to educate our member companies about and where the research is really focused. My particular research, we've always focused on the scale of data, you know, doing big data, but uh, in, in terms of number of bytes, but the uh, variety problem is something that really we feel like is new and where the research is um, has been pushing on the last few years.